Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we're gonna talk about the first lesson in algebra, the second term, logarithm. You know that 25 as a number equals 5 power 2. And you know also 1000 equals 10 to the power 3. If I ask you about the 25 to represent it as a number 5, then what is the power of 5 to get 25? You will tell me the power is 2. And if I ask you what is the power of 10 to get 1000 or to put 1000 as a 10 in the base, and what is the power? You will tell the power is 3. Now, I can express this equation as the form of logarithm. Logarithm here is asking about the power. Log 25 to the base 5 means 5 power what equals 25. 5 power 2 equals 25. 5 is the base and 2 is the power. Now log 1000 to the base 10 means 10 power what equals 1000? You will tell 3 because the 10 to the power 3 equals 1000. Now let's put this in the form of a rule. A power y equals x. You can write it as logarithm x to the base a equals y. To check your answer, cancel log by your eyes and push a to the other side and a will push y to the power. So it will be x equals a to the power y like the first equation but you have to know that x cannot be any negative number or zero and a cannot be any negative number or zero it will be any number positive except one and we will discuss it later about y it can be any number of the real numbers so y is belong to r and x belongs to R positive, no zero, no negative, and A belongs to R positive except one. For example number one, the question is change to exponential form. He means by changing to exponential form to take the log form and change to power or exponent form. Now the question is log logarithm 128 to the base 2 equals 7. This is the logarithm form. Now if I want to change to exponent form by your eyes, cancel log and push 2 in the other side and 2 will push 7 up in the power. So 128 equals 2 power 7. The next, logarithm 7 to the base 49 equals half. To write it in the equation form or exponent form, push 40, 49 in the other side and 7 will be equal to 49 to the power half. What the meaning of 7 equals 49 to the power half? I can understand it. That's a y root 49, the square root of 49. You know that 49 to the power half means square root of 49 because power half means the square root. Power half means square root and you know that root 49 equals 7 so 7 equals 49 to the power half now you get it next logarithm 1 over 81 to the base 3 equals negative 4 can you write it in the exponent form yes it will be what 
cancel lock by your eyes and push 3 in the other side it will be 1 over 81 equals 3 to the power negative 4 what the meaning of this that's a why 3 to the power negative 4 means 1 over 3 to the power 4 3 to the power negative 4 means 1 over 3 power 4 and 3 power 4 equals 81 so 3 to the power negative 4 equals 1 over 81 and that's it. the last one in this example find in the exponent form this logarithm form log fifth root to 4 to the base 2 equals 2 over 5 to change this cancel log by your eyes push 2 in the other side and 2 will push 2 over 5 as a power so it will be fifth root of 4 equals 2 to the power 2 over 5 now this is because fifth root of 4 equals fifth root of 2 power 2 because 2 power 2 equals 4 so fifth root of 4 equals fifth root of 2 power 2 and this equal 2 to the power inner power over the outer power 2 to the power 2 over 5 thank you see you soon inshallah in the next part of this lesson